the World Trade Center. But no one's in here. We have no idea what we're doing, but it's gonna be an adventure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Be honest, uh, uh, on this next? Wow. <laughs> wow. This is so cool. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you see, you can see the Brooklyn Bridge. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, Florida? Oh, it's like legit not constructed. Whoa. There's literally no floor, nothing to this floor. How crazy. We are on the 73rd floor of the One World Trade Center. Um, exploring <laughs> a floor that has not been constructed yet. As soon as we got off the elevator, it was a step down because there's literally just concrete. So this is, uh, this is amazing. Checking out the infrastructure and the view. It is a little foggy today, but you can still see the skyline, the river, and the traffic down below. <laughs> this, is, this is beyond incredible. I, wow. Everything that we've done so far, I've never imagined that I'd have this, this experience of actually doing it, so. Um, for all my military folks out there, if you do get the opportunity to attend a strategic broadening seminar, definitely sign up. You will learn a lot. It's the Brooklyn Bridge right there. I do know one thing. I definitely don't. We'll go over here. Statue of Liberty. She's a little foggy, but she's still there. This is amazing. say that's the North Tower um, fountain that we were at the other day, the Oculus Center, which is that mall. This is incredible. They set up a uh, refreshment table for us. We got coffees and waters, pastries, and fruits. So um, it is only nine o'clock in the morning, but we all just woke up and uh, got on the bus to come here. And this is here. I believe over there is the New Jersey side. Um, wow. You know, as I'm sitting here eating my breakfast, um, I see these green topped buildings. I don't know if you guys can see green topped buildings. I wonder if those used to be copper, similar to the Statue of Liberty. And uh, I wonder if they used to be copper at one time and then just being exposed to the environment, they turned green. I don't know. Looking at the skyline, it makes me wonder.
from the Port Authority. And uh, we're gonna go tour like super below ground and figure everything out. built after 9-11. There's two subways. There's a subway that goes that way. There's a pathway that goes this way. There's one that goes underneath the ground to New Jersey. But a cool thing about this and the way that they built it, they built it at an angle in comparison to all the other buildings surrounding it. And this window right here on 9-11 at 10:28, these windows open and it allows the light to shine through that signifies the collapse of the second tower it's quite quite amazing it resembles a lot and uh it's pretty cool Fun of me the entire time. <laughs> yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Shout out your handles. <laughs> but yeah, never in a million years would I thought I would be in New York City at a private athletic club overlooking Central Park with a glass of wine. This is this is awesome. Um, it's truly, truly an experience. A wonderful experience that is definitely in the books. Um, so all of these amazing people behind me, uh, it's, it's been a great time and it's only day three, day four. Oh my gosh, it's such an amazing experience. Um, something I would truly carry um, throughout my career, uh, both in the military and whenever I eventually retire. <laughs> um, so yeah, enjoy these the rest of the footage whatever I can gather and uh, yeah we're, we're gonna have a great time so check out uh, Central Park right now yeah. you're welcome you know true story is that I'm getting spoiled with the luxuries, I guess, of New York City, but eventually I'll find myself in a position in a job where this will be life, but by the mountains with my husband and my dog, so. <laughs> but for now, uh, gotta corral and take a good photo. <laughs> 